Whoa! What an episode of Dragon Ball Super. Episode 100. Already! We're only two years in. Let's talk about it. What's good, y'all? It is your boy, Coltrane, back with another video. This will be the second video for Monday, for your Monday um, evening pleasure. This will be your, your Dragon, official Dragon Ball Super episode 100 review and results and 101 predictions. What a show we had. For this week, Dragon Ball Super was impressive. Battleground was impressive. I had a great Sunday, man. Sunday was enjoyable. Spun time with the family. That's why you didn't really see. That's why you didn't really see that many videos. A lot of videos will be coming this week, and a lot of live streams will be coming this week. So it's gonna be a big week for the channel as we almost, as we're only two weeks away from school time. So I gotta get these videos out as quickly as possible. So, so I can keep the grind going as we head into the last summer month before we head into the fall months and when we get to the newer games coming out. Um, so yeah, let's get into Dragon Ball Super Review. We've seen Kale turn legendary Super Saiyan. Goku versus Khalifa. I'm sorry, excuse me about that. I'm um, sorry about that. And uh, Super Saiyan 2. And also Vegeta struggling a little bit more, and we've seen a couple of eliminations. Episode kicked off where we last left off with Goku, with Goku and Vegeta. Vegeta was struggling. They talked about Krillin being eliminated. Andrew 17 and 18 are now working together in um to to stop the um threat. Um, also we've seen um a, a, a bits and pieces of Kale getting beat up by some. I think it was believe it was Universe. Yeah, I think some some Universe. Uh, Five or universe two or three, um, two or three or oh, I think universe five or six, crone, whatever, some other universe cronies getting beat up, but uh, luckily Kale saved her and knocked out some of the uh, some of the uh, the the fighters from that universe, shocking the Supreme Kai. And Kale said, "You got to be tougher than that. You can and you, you need to go into your legendary form. I'm going to call it her legendary Super Saiyan Khalifa because I'm not. I'm, I, I mean." I think they they call it a caliph. I don't know why. I hopefully we get the English transition sooner rather than later. Hopefully by twenty eighteen, we should be in the um Terminator Power arc um for the English dub, but more than likely now. I think we can be early early twenty eighteen to mid twenty eighteen. We should be in the uh Terminator Power arc for the Dragon Ball Super English dub. That's the slowly but surely they're almost done with the regular version the F arc. But anyway, guys, we've seen that. Um, we've seen Super Saiyan 2, Kale versus... I believe, no, Super Saiyan 2, what's the... the, the it was, is it Kale or Khalifa? Uh, I think I think the Super Saiyan, the girl with the likes... I think I think it's Kale versus Super Saiyan 2, Goku. That was a good that was a good fight and, and scene. I really enjoyed that. She learned Super Saiyan 2 very, very quickly. Goku just transformed and she put her power in there. Goku told her she went Ascendant Saiyan very, very quickly and learned Super Saiyan 2 in the same episode. You know how long it took Goku to learn Super Saiyan 2? It took him 10 years. 10 years. And then she learned it in one day. <laughs> I'm going to say a matter of minutes. She learned Super Saiyan 2. So Dragon Ball Super really loved these Universe 6, the Universe 6 chicks. Because they have a lot of power. And I, and I think Kill could be a Super Saiyan 3. Or, or heading into Super Saiyan God by the end of this tournament. I'm telling you guys. They're really, they're really boosting this girl up. And I and I and I really want to see more more Khalifa and Cleo Kale as this tournament goes on. And they were the highlights of this episode. And um and then at the end of the episode, Kale turned super legendary Super Saiyan Khalifa. Um and uh, I'm gonna just call it Legendary Super Saiyan Kale and she just dominated Goku. Goku went in his blue form and did a Super Saiyan Blue Kamehameha. And just like they did with Broly when 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 Goku did a Kamehameha back when he was a regular Super Saiyan, the Broly Legendary Super Saiyan movie, Kale re literally did this walked through the um Kamehameha and, and, and just like they did with Broly, Go Broly said Kakarot a lot. Kale said Son Goku a lot. But at the end of the episode, Jiren actually stepped in and fought and laid out Kale with one. 
punched. But luckily, Khalifa was there to save Kel from being eliminated. So we're going to see more Kel. Hopefully, we'll see more Kel Goku. But next episode is going to be the Universe 11 Pride Troopers taking on Universe 7, Universe Goku, Vegeta 17, and 18, and the others. And hopefully, now we get to see the Pride Troopers. The, I, say, I say the Ginyu Force 2.0, who are stronger than the Ginyu Force. Because they actually had the same mega in in a manner like like the Ginyu Force. I think Jiren is the freezer of the freezer of them because he's the most powerful one of the out, out of all of them. We're gonna see the Pride was finally fight in the tournament power one on one prediction. My one on one prediction is I think that Goku and Jiren will fight throughout the rest of the episode, and I think I, I think at least three or four of the Pride Troopers will be eliminated, and Goku will go Super Saiyan Blue at the end of the episode. To go full power against Jiren. Hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you did, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Now you guys have not been watching Dragon Ball Super Reviews over the past couple of weeks. I don't know what's going on. I guess you're just catching up with the series. I don't know. Dragon Ball Super Reviews have not been popular since the first review I did. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did like, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on Tuesday with the raw review and my train talks. And if anything else comes up, I'll let you guys know. I'm Cold Train. I'll talk to you guys in the next one.